guys, so I'm doing a What's in My Travel makeup bag, and let me make this intro really short. I would have uploaded this before, but, like, they didn't have Wi-Fi at the, where I was staying at, and I can't tell you guys where I went because it's in my state, and I don't want you guys to know where it lived. But, um, that's mostly it, and let me just start with the makeup bag. Okay, so this is my makeup bag, as you can see in the thumbnail. It just like this like rectangular boxing and it, the material is like really soft so it squishes with your suitcase which is really cool and I picked this one because it matches perfectly with my room because my room's like black and white if you can see this pillow right here it's black and white and then my walls are blue and this used to be like a little ribbon but I kind of messed it up as you can see and I should probably fix that but so it just has little Eiffel Tower since my room's Paris thing and stuff. I just like it a lot. So I broke the zipper, so I'm going to unzip it right now. And I didn't bring that much stuff since it was like really, really hot where I went. So, so I'm just going to start with what I see first. And yeah. So the first thing I brought was my Neutrogena Oil Free Moisturizer, which is what I use because I love this moisturizer and I really recommend it. And it has SPF 15 since it was really hot where I went. Next I brought deodorant, which isn't really makeup, but it's a necessity for most people, I hope. Next I brought this little LA Colors like eyeshadow palette. This has some neutral colors and there's like 10. And this is in Mineral Spa. Next, for the pool, since I went swimming, I brought the falsies in waterproof, just to put a little bit of mascara and some, um, to add a touch to my lashes. Next, I brought my L flat shader brush, which is this one, just looks like this. And next, I brought a blending brush, just in case I went out, you know, for dinner or something. Next, I brought Max Vanilla, which just looks like this. a very creamy vanilla color, which is what vanilla is. And then here's the name. Next, I brought my Stila palette in Daydream, and it's just a really pretty palette with lots of colors, and I would really recommend it. Next, I brought my NYX eyeshadow base in Pearl, and it's like this really pigmented white. It's really nice for pigmented colors and yeah. so there's that. Next I brought some makeup removers and these are just the Target brand and they actually work really well. Next I brought a eyeliner and it's just a pencil and this is from MAC and it's an Ebony just a black. Next I brought my Sephora foundation powder because I don't like foundation. It's really heavy and I don't think you really need it. But this has SPF 15 in it which is really good and I'm in the shade 25 if you were wondering. And I did the baggie because I broke the lid off and I didn't want it to go all over my other makeup. Next is this e.l.f concealer in fair glow just looks like this I broke the other side and I break everything but um I just use this as a eyeshadow primer because it's way too light for my skin it may not look like it but it next I bought a elf powder brush okay so the thing I bought and I tried it out today because I got it yesterday night and I went to three stores where I live and they did not have it but they had it there so this is the Maybelline Dream Fresh BB Green uh, BB Green Cream and I'm in light to medium because I went to three other stores here I went to Target, CVS and a bunch of other stores and they did not have it like I was so mad but I finally found it and it's I'm in light to medium yeah and it just looks like this and I was so happy when I got it it's so awesome I tried it out today and I haven't even retouched my powder or anything and it just left me with a really nice finish next I brought the Maybelline cover stick 
which is a really good conceal um, dry eye concealer. Next, I brought the Maybelline Bed Plus Volume Mascara, and it kind of matches my fingernails. My fingernails are all like jacked up, like. So you got the picture. Hey, look! You know, I just noticed they're kind of like opposite because the blue right here, and then yeah, okay, whatever. And next, I brought my. White and Wild Mega Liner, and I would not recommend this at all. Do not buy it. It just really sucks, but I bought it, and I have to use it up because I do not want to waste makeup. Next, I brought a eyelash curler. It's just like this, like usually what a eyelash curler looks like. Next, I brought this really nice eyeshadow palette from Victoria's Secrets, and this is an Ombre Apari. I don't, I don't know, but it's just like, it comes with two colors, and there's this kind of like, light champagne -y color, kind of looks like this, just really light and shimmery, and then this dark one, and I put the light one on my lid, and then the dark one on my crease, and it's just a really nice, simple little palette to work with, and the colors are really pretty, I really, would really recommend that. Next I brought my baby lips since it was really hot and I didn't want my lips to get burnt. So I just brought this one and this one's just in quench and it's just like this kind of clear one because I didn't really want to wear color a lot. So yeah, and the packaging is so cute on these. And yeah, so that is what's in my makeup bag. I'm sorry I didn't upload it before. They did not have Wi-Fi in my hotel where I stayed at, which really sucked because I couldn't check YouTube or anything, or Instagram or anything, so make sure you follow me on Instagram, though. It's Paulina with three A's and then a 14, so, yep, and I will talk to you guys later, and bye!